What's going on guys? Welcome back for another reaction. Today we are checking out, is it GOT7 or GOT7? I don't even know. That's how little I know about these guys, but I wanted to check them out today because I've been getting a lot of requests. If you're not new here, then you probably realize that I have a different background going on today. Guys, I'm in Costa Rica. I moved here for a little bit. I'm chilling here with my girlfriend and uh, you know, we got a beautiful jungle on the back. So. I hope you enjoy that too. Either way, thanks for tuning in. If you haven't yet, hit that subscribe button. We just hit 50,000 subscribers. I'm pumped. So thanks for tuning in. Let's check out the boys today. Hi. Okay, you know what I'm gonna do really, really quickly is I'm literally YouTubing GOT7 pronunciation. How do you pronounce GOT7? Why isn't it showing? We're gonna screw that and we're just gonna go straight into the video. I'm gonna say GOT7 for now. I'm sure I'll get corrected soon. Actually, it was the first day I arrived in Korea. I saw Jin Young holding like a notebook. He was so into dancing and especially popping. When I was training. Okay, so that's my very first impression of the infamous Jackson Wang, who I've heard a lot about and who I will probably check out separately. But right away, I mean, you can tell in the first few seconds, the guy is loaded with charisma. And just the way he presents on camera, very smooth, natural, doesn't seem to be nervous at all. Time to time, he, he, he does like this when he eats. I'm like, what's wrong with this guy? And I thought, oh, he was so handsome. And then I figure out that, oh, he's really a, a maniac, hardcore dancer. Comfortable, good presenter, good with his gestures, Jackson is. Jin Young calling Jackson handsome, that's such a Korean thing, right? I remember when I first moved there, like immediately, someone called me handsome, and I was like, wow, I was flattered. And then I heard them call every one of my friends handsome. I'm like, oh, okay, I guess that's a thing here. He's like a true-hearted friend, yeah, a friend for life, I would say. Because he's very free. It's like always relaxed, always calm. After 50, 60 years, if I'm still alive, I think I would spend time with him. Like, uh, yeah. Yeah, he's my best friend. Uh, that's sweet. That's really sweet. That's cool. I like Jin Young too. He seems like a humble guy. Like I said, I think the word to describe Jackson right away is he's smooth. I think Jin Young put it best. He's kind of like an actor. Um, he looks like a movie star. Very Hollywood, and not in a bad way at all. It's just he's got a presence about him. I was to be a youngest in a company all the time, but then someday a big guy came into company. Okay, yeah, I was gonna say, Yugyum does look like a big guy. Definitely looks like a big guy. Does anyone know how tall he is? And right away, they have a presence about them. They seem a little older than some of the other groups that I've reacted to. Yeah, no, I enjoy it, I enjoy it. I think this is really one of the reasons why I enjoy reacting to K-pop groups and Korean artists is because they speak so openly about each other. Now, it's really nice to hear other people compliment each other and I think it's a sign of humility when you're able to, you know, drop your own ego and praise someone else, right? And I think we as viewers enjoy watching that. So, you know, these guys do it really well, it seems like. And he was like, I'm your friends, we same age. <laughs> I was like this small, this guy was like this big. What the hell? <laughs> yeah, that's how I first met him. We used to fight a lot at the beginning, and then because of the fight a lot, so we like slowly start to understand each other. What, a, what an interesting group of guys so far, just very different individuals it seems like. I'm curious to see what they're all like together, what their energy is like as a group, but real different from all the other K-pop groups that I've analyzed. And it's cool like in, in the Korean culture how you can just automatically bond with someone who's your age. That's kind of nice. All right, Mark. But he was with Youngjae. It was a really quick interaction. We just said, hi, what's up? Oh, I'll see you soon at the company. And he just looked like a really innocent, just like a regular high school kid. We're parents of a dog, yes, uh, a Maltese. I'm the dad and he's the mom. Uh, before we get into JB here, Mark, he's kind of got a smoothness about him too. Doesn't seem as outwardly like Hollywood as like a Jackson Wang, but 
He's definitely got a charisma about him too. He has a smooth way of speaking as well. I'm gonna have to watch him a little more too. 하나의 사건이 있었는데 <웃음> 마크랑 저랑 싸우게 된 거예요. 네. 그러다가 마, 뭐 결론적으로는 마크가 힘들어서 울었어요. 그런데 제가 너무 미안한 거죠. 그래서 아 나도 너무 미안하다. 나도 내가 너한테 너무 Yeah, these guys are unbelievably open about crying and getting emotional. Again, more of a Korean thing. To me, I think that's a big part of being happy is just the ability to express yourself freely and not worry about um, putting on false pretenses or hiding your emotions, hiding how you feel, right? Because you're holding a lot inside. You know, it's just just a different way of, of, of moving through life. <laughs> 사실 장난칠 때가 제일 재밌는 것 같아요. 왜냐면 약간 약간 개그 코드가 많이 맞는 것 같아서. Yeah, cool, cool. But just really quickly, a note about Young Jay. Seems like a sweet guy over there. Just notice what he's doing with his hands. And this is just a little thing. And obviously, I'm just sort of picking because I don't have a lot of footage to work with here. But you can see his hands are in front of him, covering his body a little. And then after that, he put his hands behind his back. A small tell there that he might be a little less comfortable in front of the camera than some of the other guys. And a sign of that generally is if someone isn't showing their hands or if they're hiding a certain body part or if they're covering a certain body part, that could be an indication that they're a little uncomfortable speaking in public or speaking in front of the camera. Anyway, Young Jay, sweet guy, did a good job there. Just a small tell. Who knows exactly how he feels, but I thought I would comment on that. Let me know if you guys see any monkeys behind me, by the way. Apparently there's monkeys that show up in the back here. I haven't seen them yet, but let me know. Is that a good thing? Yeah. 나보다 자기 주장을 확실히 잘 말한다. 왜냐면 나는 약간 내가 마음속에 있는 말 이렇게 잘 주장 못 Just the fact that Yagyum was able to say I have a hard time to express what's eating at me. Just the fact that he was able to say that is a a way of him expressing himself. You know what I mean? 그리고 자기한테 잘 어울리는 옷을 입고 어떤 옷도 자기한테 어울리게 소화 잘한다. 음. 이런 거 원했니? 항상 양보해줘서. These guys must just be confident as hell. Just like imagine just being with a group of friends and all you do, not saying this is all they do, but you're just feeding each other compliments all day. Imagine how confident you feel. You walk around thinking you were the shit. You know what I mean? I gotta get myself a group of friends like these guys. Just constantly, you're the funniest, you're the smartest. Okay. Yeah. I want to be in a K-pop band. He always think of me first <laughs> before yeah, himself. Way. Like, he always go to the back seat because he wanted me to sit in the front seat. His heart is really kind. Yeah, that's what I like about him. Yeah, these guys are cool. These guys are different. I like Bam Bam as well. They kind of just have like a softer energy about them. They just seem a little bit more on the calm, a little bit more on the reserve side. He has a great singing voice. Thanks. Yeah, bro. bro, bro. Yeah. It's not this, man. It's not this. Ooh. It's not this like you. Yeah. <laughs> Can I just... See, that's more of an American joke. Hey. You know, like it's kind of like a fake aggressive joke. That would be more American. The Korean guys are too sweet for that. Ooh. It's not this like you. <laughs> you know, that's interesting. Mark probably brings a different dynamic to this group. And I wonder if he has a more difficult time bonding and connecting with these guys because of the language barrier. You're a very good mentor mm -hmm. to me in my life. Mm -hmm. As a friend, mm -hmm. I love you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have to say it like in yeah, front of yeah. everyone, you know? Yeah. It's something that I know the bottom of my heart. You always say to me, I'm gonna make history, I'm gonna make history. I believe. You See, this is sincere. The way they're delivering each other compliments, although I'm sure they would do this off camera. It seems like they would. They both seem like very genuine guys, right? These guys are showing that they're being sincere and they're showing that they want each other to hear what they have to say not just through their words, but a big part of it is through their body language as well. Thank you, Jim. Nice. Nice. Yeah, bud. One minute. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hug, hug, hug. Just hug. Hug. You lie, lie, lie. Come, 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 come. I got you, bro. Okay, it's done, it's done. Okay, it's done. Jin Young, can you not breathe in my face? <laughs> <laughs> 
Yeah, that, that's a tough one to do, right? The hugging for a minute, no matter how close you are, that's a tough one to do. Jackson and Jin Young did that activity with no problem, though. Nice. It's tough to say. I, I just think Mark has a little bit of a different energy. He seems like a cool guy. Definitely smooth. I'm sure he's a really nice guy, but I don't know if like his energy and his personality, I'm not sure if it fits in with the guys. Maybe it does. Again, this is just my first impression, so go easy on me, but that's just sort of what I'm seeing. Bam Bam, I know they're saying they're really close, but it does still feel like there's a disconnect just a little bit between him and Young Yoom. It might be because Young Yoom speaking Korean, Bam Bam speaking English. Maybe that's where I'm sensing it. But definitely, if I had to rate the dynamics, it certainly seems like Jin Young and uh, Jackson are the closest. But that could also just be a result of them being really comfortable on camera. <laughs> Yug Yum smooth for a big man. Huh? Nice. Oh, what? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, these boys have some moves. These boys have some moves, no doubt. See you next life. Okay, three. Cool. Got seven. Got seven. I, I, I'm gonna have to see more of these guys, okay? I'm gonna have to see more of these guys. Jackson stood out to me, obviously. I only saw a little bit of him, but very composed, right? Notice the way he looks at the camera. Notice the way that he's just not fidgety with his hands. He's smooth, controlled, and slow with his movements. Really like Jin Young's presence as well. Kind of plays that fatherly role in a way, but he's got this sort of cuteness to him as well, this innocence to him as well. Mark, you know, he's sort of like the wild card in the group to me because he's bringing this more like American energy. He teases the guys in a different way. And JB seemed very jovial, outspoken, sort of like a, a real positive guy who spreads the light amongst the group. So guys, if you want to watch my uncut reaction and analysis, you can. All you need to do is click on my Patreon link below. I've also got a ton of other content on my Patreon page, uncut, tons of live reactions, tons of other K-pop groups. Other than that, I appreciate you tuning in. I will catch you soon. Peace.